Well, welcome back. Hollywood's love affair with biopics continues this week as Machine Gun Preacher hits the big screen. It tells the story of a pastor who will stop at nothing to protect the children of Sudan. And recently, Carol Evans' Christina Vandre met up with the film's stars and the real man behind the movie to find out more. I've done a lot of things that I ain't proud of. I've hurt a lot of people. You can't keep going the way you've been going. Gerard Butler goes from a sinner to a not-so-saintly saint in his gritty new drama, Machine Gun Preacher. I'm here today to talk to you about families just like yours, half a world away, that desperately need your help. Butler plays Sam Childers, a real-life gun-toting ex-con who rescues orphans in war-torn Sudan. And Michelle Monaghan co-stars as his wife, Lynn. We use the word hero a lot, and we use it, I think, in the wrong context. Yeah, true, and I kind of worn down, raw, mm -hmm. truthful kind of way. I mean, he's a hero, but I think he's an anti-hero, and I think that he's really, you know, there's so much to Sam, and there's a dark side to him, there's an irreverent side, there's a humor to him, there's a, you know, there's an insensitivity to him. All of those things that came in to make this guy who could do those things, nobody mm -hmm. else could have done it. Yeah. But is he purely that swashbuckling hero that you think of in, in American movies, uh, uh, you know, or folklore? No, not at all. But that's what made this story and him so much more interesting because it's not perfectly wrapped. You associate with this guy, you understand him as a human being, and yet he's off out there shooting him up and defending kids. Um, which is kind of cool, because in a way, because you agree with them, you think you're doing the same thing. You're like, I'm there. I'm there fighting those guys. I'm there protecting those kids. And to me, that's a great feeling. I can't do it no more, Lynn. It's over. Sam. Yeah. Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Them kids have had their whole lives burned to the ground and worse. How many of them you see giving up? Both actors spend a lot of time with their off-screen counterparts, and Monaghan says she respects Sam's wife for sticking by her man, even when times were tough. And I realized there was a woman who really believed in Sam, and, and first and foremost, I, I will use her words, that she's married to God, you know, and secondly, she's married to Sam, but she, she really believes that Sam's doing God's work, you know, and that's incredible, you know, to be able to stick with somebody through thick and thin. Hey, come on, get up. What are you doing? Let's go, get up. They ain't sleeping out here. Tell them they're coming inside. Come on, y'all get up. Sam. Let's go. Sam, there are too many. You can't help them all. You were given a second chance. Yeah. They're given a second chance. Uh, you know, everyone keeps saying, Sam, you rescued all these children. Really, I didn't rescue any, child, uh, any of the children. They rescued me. Mm. You know, so all the children that we have that... We found in the villages that were raided, that we found in ambushes or wherever they come from, they rescued me, every one of them. See this? Yes. This girl watched her family being killed and then they set her on fire. This is not necessary. That? No, 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 John, just look it. at John, John, look at the picture. Look, look at the picture. Childers admits it's strange seeing his life played on on the big screen, but he credits screenwriter Jason Keller with getting to the heart of his story. I started to see those eyes that you see in the movie and they haunted me and and they moved me um, and I carried those eyes around with me and it was an incredible burden. So really that was the hardest thing is wanting to do right by those children. The movie is not about Sam Childers. It's about you. Now what are you going to do? It's not just about children in Sudan. It's about children around the world dying. What are you going to do? Helping you kids is about the only good thing I've ever done in this life. You got no idea what I'm saying, do you? Machine Gun Preacher opens the theaters nationwide tomorrow, Friday, September 30th.